in the previous lecture we completed all these get and set functions i hope you have completed them and uh, now we have these two warnings here so we have to implement binary to bcd and bcd to binary i'll show you the code for that now let's understand how to convert binary to bcd and bcd to binary first let's understand how to convert binary into bcd let's take one number let's say 12 a number 12 which can be written as 0, 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 0 in 8 bit binary isn't it this is binary and in bcd it looks something like this 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 1, 0. this is bcd the conversion is very simple here let's consider this as m and this digit as n this is n and m so what you need to do is let's call it as value or let's call it as x if x is greater than or equal to 10 then you have to separate this m and n so m is equal to x divided by 10 isn't it integer division gives you m isn't it the digit which is in the tenth position this will give you one n is equal to how to get n very simple x modulus 10 this gives you two you have got m as one and n as two so you have to separate those two digits and after that you just have to club it so bcd is equal to m left shifted by 4 ordering with n that will give you the bcd version of the binary value there are different logics this is one logic you can use this method suppose if x is let's say 41 then 41 divided by 10 so m will be 4 and 41 modulus 10 n will be 1 hence you get the bcd by using this method m is left shifted by 4 that means you get something like this 0 1 0 0 0 0 0 0 this is m left shifted by 4 so let's say m is 4 and after that you have got n which is 1 that is 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 1 this is n ordering m and n gives you 0 1 0 0 0 0 0 1 this is in bcd format of 41 so let's use this method here let me just write another function here static void or u int 8 underscore t binary to bcd let's take the input as x or i can call it as value let's take u it eight underscore t m and n first if value is greater than or equal to 10 m is equal to value divided by 10 n is equal to value modulus 10 that's it let me create one more variable here bcd so bcd is equal to m left shifted by 4 ordering with n the whole result let's type cast into u int 8 underscore t and you just return bcd here if value is less than 10 then the bcd must be equal to the value that's it 
that's why initialize bcd is equal to value if value is less than 10 then that value is returned otherwise this variable is modified like this so now let's implement a function which converts a bcd into binary let's again take the number 12 what's bcd of this 0, 0, 0, 1. 0, 0, 1, 0, isn't it? This is a BCD. Let's divide this into a two groups of four bits. Let's call it as M and this is N. First, let's extract M. Let's call it as X. M is equal to X right shifted by 4. And you have to multiply this value by 10. Here m is actually 1, isn't it? n is 2. So this result gives you 10, isn't it? And n is equal to x, you know, bitwise and 0 cross f or 0f, isn't it? You have to mask these upper four bits. This is bitwise and with 0 cross 0f, zero which gives you 2, isn't it? The result is equal to, so you just have to add this m plus n, which is 10 plus 2 is equal to 12, like that. Let's do this. Suppose if uh, x is less than 10 so if x is equal to 9 let's say 9 means 0 0 0 0 1 0 0 1 isn't it this is m this is n m is anyway 0 that's why this will be 0 and n is 9 so this will be 9 so 0 plus 9 is equal to 9 like that let's write another function here Static u int 8 underscore t bcd to binary u int 8 underscore t value. So let's take these values here. Let's create these variables. Let me call it as bin m is equal to value right shifted by 4 multiplied by 10. I'm just using more variables here just to teach you in simplified way. You can get rid of these variables and you can make it look compact. This is just for explaining purpose. I'm using so many variables. After that, n is equal to value bitwise ending with 0 cross 0 f. That's it. Here, let me type cast this into u int 8 underscore t. Here, the final product should be type casted to u int 8 underscore t. So, this is a value of u int 8, which is right shifted by 4 and multiplied by 10. After that, the result is equal to that is binary is equal to m plus n and then return bin or you can just return m plus n here that's it now let's add the prototype of these two functions you can go at the top and you can paste here So that works.